Hey guys, oh, got a bit of a glare from the sun. Got Jimmy behind me, and then our hunter. We're out actually taking down camera arms off of stands. I'm gonna take one of my stands down, and we have found a tom. So turkey season starts in about a month, and we just heard heard a big one gobble a couple of times. So we're trying to get him to gobble again. Anyways, we have found us a turkey to hunt, so maybe in April, when season starts, we will have a turkey hunt for you guys. Um, we're heading down the swamp right now to get that stand, get camera arms. We're going to watch for mushrooms while we're here. Um, people have been saying that they're finding morels, so we love eating them, so we're going to hunt for those too. Keep our eye open for sheds. Some of the bucks have shed. Most of them, we are seeing horns still on them in cameras. Um, I actually had a picture of like five really big ones, so we know there's some good ones that, that made it through. Maybe next year I'll have a better year hunting. Um, but if we see any wildlife, we find any mushrooms or anything, we'll turn the camera back on and do some more video. Out below. Uh. Yeah, uh -huh. the best side. <laughs> uh -huh. well, what, what everyone wants to see a big fat guy coming up in the ladder. So, huh? They're climbing down from here. Well, they get in the best view. <laughs> What? I don't know if you can tell with the sun on it, but that's a buck rub. That's about 25, 30 yards from my stand. This is a stand that I. Let me flip you around. This is a stand that I shot. Uh, walk around it, Bubba. This is a stand that I shot a pretty decent buck out of didn't find him but flip your back around you see Jimmy right over there that's about where he was at when I shot him crows are going crazy watching and listening for turkeys while we're in here so we've heard them, that one. Uh, we've heard actually, I think two, maybe three different turkeys gobble. So, I'm just kind of listening. We've got a month until season, so hoping the hogs don't kill them and hoping to hang out in here. Hogs have been a big problem. We've caught a bunch of them. Uh, the guy that's been trapping on us, he caught about 50 off of us so I'd say he did pretty good I helped him load one and then he got stuck a couple of times had to come and try to help him get unstuck but he uh, was just too too much for my little tractor had to bring an excavator to get himself out I gotta work those ruts over because that's where I'm gonna plant soybeans. There goes the turkey again. I doubt y'all could hear him. We're about to walk over to the uh, saddle and take it down. And then we'll hit the last stand on the way up to get the last camera arm down and we'll uh, hopefully we can get a turkey on film. Jimmy's never killed a turkey. Me either. You either? <laughs> I know you haven't, Bubba. We'll get you one too. But Jimmy's never never killed a turkey, so I've killed several. I've killed them with bow. I've killed them crossbow, shotgun. So, uh, 
plan is going to be to see if we can get Jimmy on a turkey on film and get him his first one. Even if it's Jake, we'll be happy with that as long as it's legal. Um, I've got a couple spots in mind if they stay over here where we can set up or I know they might come. If you need to pee, baby, go pee. <sighs> but, uh, yeah, it's going to be fun times. So, we've got two weeks. We've got the big hunt coming up. Well, less than two weeks, actually. Like eight days, I think, actually, if you want to get precise. Of myself, Ryder, my wife, and his wife all going on a on exotic hunt. Uh, me and Desi are both going to shoot. Um, me and Desi are both going to shoot a uh, a ram. I'm shooting a four horn. She's shooting a big course again, and I mean a big course again, bigger than the one I've got at my house on the wall. Uh, Ryder's going to shoot an orx and his wife's going to shoot some kind of ram um, and, and I'll talk about it more when we do the hunt but the way he does hunts over there is really cool he's got the super exotics which would be like my four horn um, big rams I mean like big gold gold medal ram what people call gold medal rams you know likelihood of making uh, record books in one pen and then you know like the eland that I shot the fallow deer that if you watch the channel you saw my dad shoot those others they're all in one pen and then he's got another pen that he's got hogs sheep odd and goats in and uh, it's kind of unique how he does that like I said I'll talk more when we actually do the hunt about how he does that and I'm gonna see if he wants to be on film this time and talk about the the place a little bit if he doesn't you know that's fine some people don't like to be on camera but um anyways i'm going to shut you all off for a second i'm trying to find jimmy i have no idea where he disappeared to might have to go find him um but then we're going to come over and we're going to take the uh other he, went sand down. he went that way yeah. all right so we're going to go find jimmy and then we're going to come take this saddle down and then we're going to go up take the last camera down maybe look around for mushrooms a little bit and find anything else i'll turn you guys back on uh, you're probably bored of listening to me talk <laughs> all right guys so hopefully you can hear us so our goals we're going to get to we want to get to a thousand subscribers help us do that like subscribe share our, our videos when we hit a thousand subscribers we're going to give away a hunt i like hunting black mountain hunts Ryder and courtney are going to be going with us on monday um so they'll probably be enjoying it probably be going back with us uh as soon as well but we are going to give a hunt away there it's going to be either for a hog a ram or a goat uh, we'll give you all the rules and everything when we get to that point uh, but help us get there guys appreciate us